a blessed day and welcome this morning we will be meditating on the book of james chapter 1 and verse 3 knowing that the testing of your faith produces patience the main response that god expects from us is faith according to hebrews 11 verse 6 god's word declares that without faith it is impossible to please god this means that faith is the most important element in a disciple's life and the one mode that god uses to increase our faith in him is suffering in life there will be those jubilant moments but life also has its moments of thorns that comes unexpectedly to prick the comfort of our faith just as a rose has thorns around it we cannot gather the fragrant flower without the presence of its rough companion therefore we cannot increase our faith in god without experiencing the trials of life because faith and trials go together i would like to narrate a story that i read last winter while visiting a natural history museum in colorado i learned some remarkable facts about the aspen tree an entire grove of slender white trunked aspens can grow from a single seed and share the same root system the root systems can exist for thousands of years whether or not they produce trees they sleep underground waiting for fire flood or avalanche to clear a space for them in the shady forest after a natural disaster has cleared the land aspen roots can sense the sun at last the roots send up saplings which become trees for aspens new growth is made possible by the devastation of a natural disaster testing is like the refining of metal it produces a better product through the process endurance is the better translation here it means to stand fast or persevere rc trench thus the man who has faced great trials and endured is not easily provoked or angered by difficult people neither does he lose heart under great trials we might call it spiritual toughness in the same way when we endure trials by faith our faith is stronger for the next trial we know that we can endure because we've already been through previous trials and when we endure trials by faith with joy it brings glory to our lord and savior thus when we encounter trials we should adopt the radical attitude of counting it all joy we should understand the reassuring truth that our sovereign god is using it to develop enduring faith let us pray father thank you for every trial that comes my way it's meant to build my faith help me to remain strong and rejoice in every circumstance in jesus name i pray amen shalom maranatha